Hey everybody, welcome to Wednesday Night Collide. Uh, I'm Pastor Daniel, and this is our YouTube channel. Uh, we'd love for you guys to check us out on our other social media, Instagram and Facebook. Uh, we even have a TikTok. Last week, uh, Pastor Matt was talking about being ambassadors for God and how we can be an influence. And this week, I want to talk about being an influence uh, just the way Jesus was. In Matthew 6, 33... It says, seek the kingdom of God above all else and live righteously and he will give you everything you need. Now, you're probably asking, well, what do I need? Well, I'm glad you asked. I'm going to tell you a little story about my nephew. When he was seven, he went to the store with his dad and he runs to the toy section. And when he came back, he had this big uh, Spider-Man action figure and said to his dad, Dad, I need Spider-Man. And his dad said, no, son, you have enough toys. You don't need an another toy. And his reply was, no, Daddy, I need Spider-Man. Sometimes our view of what we need is very different than the way God views our needs. He's our creator the Bible says that he knows the numbers uh, of the hair on your head. And that blows me away. Like, how in the world can he know how many hair I have on my head? He created us. He knows our needs. And he promises to, to supply our needs. So, you say, what does it mean to seek the kingdom of God? Does God live in a big castle? I don't know about you, when I think of the word kingdom, I think castles and kings and knights fighting great battles with swords and bow and arrow. But that doesn't paint a very clear picture of God's kingdom. God's kingdom is so much more than that. In John 14, verse 6, Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. Now that's a bold statement. For Jesus to say that he's the only way to heaven to be with the Father, that's a pretty crazy statement if it wasn't true. But it is true. And more than that, he wants us to have a relationship with him. And his life on earth is our example of how to live. Jesus was selfless, and he loved unconditionally. He was honest, and he was bold. Jesus spoke truth, and he was an influence to everyone. He viewed people very differently than we do. Now, social media is definitely not something that I am good at, but I'm working on it because it's a great way to communicate with anyone all over the world. But it wasn't until recently that I made it a priority. And, and I'm trying because it is a great platform to give God glory and just tell people about Jesus. So I challenge you, what what is your your story look like? What is your Facebook post or your Instagram, your pictures, uh, your feed, your wall? What does it look like? When I look at mine, I want it to say that I love Jesus and I want to tell you about him. And I want you to know him the way that I know him. I want to be the difference in this world. When we seek an honest relationship with Jesus Christ, it brings life and joy. I've been all over the world and I've done a lot of things, but nothing compares to my relationship with Jesus Christ. It gives me a joy that I've never known in anything else. It gives me life. I feel alive and nothing else compares to that. And I wouldn't know Jesus if it wasn't for someone else 
telling me about Jesus and what he did for me. And that's what Jesus wants for you. Jesus is calling you to be an influence. Wherever you're at, in your community. And that means that we must seek life to give life in order to be the difference. When we seek Jesus and we have a close relationship with him, he will show us things that we never knew and help us to do things we never thought we could do. Jesus is calling you to be an influence so that he can shine through you to be a light of influence to the broken people around you. There are so many people out there that need Jesus and his love, and they won't know until we tell them. So go be a light. God bless you guys. I hope you join us on Facebook, um, YouTube, um, and I really hope you join us in our Zoom uh, small group classes. Uh, it'll help change your life. God bless.